Yeah, Splat Nation, what it do? It's your boy, the real M14, and we're back once again with Sonic Media. Let's continue. I know, man, it's been like, what, two? Two weeks? Might have been three. I think two weeks since the last Sonic Mania video, but, you know what I mean? My work schedule, it just hasn't been all that favorable lately. I've been working, they had me working weekends like the last two weeks, and, you know, that's out of my control, so. It is what it is, but y'all don't want to hear about that. Y'all want to hear about this Sonic Mania action. So we're going to dive back into things. I know when we last finished, we finished Mirage Saloon Act, Act 2, and we moved on to the Oil Ocean Zone, and that's what we're about to pick up. Oil Ocean Zone Act 1. Now, I don't know, man. Usually I would have some interesting things to say, but to be honest with you guys, I never was the biggest fan of the original Oil Ocean Zone. I was very surprised that they brought it back in this game. Honestly, I don't know. Like, besides the music in Oil Ocean Zone, I find Oil Ocean to be pretty boring. But let me show you guys something. You want to get this shield? Jump down here. Pretty cool, and then you uh, jump up on here, and get this big ring. So that's a big ring location in case you guys didn't know about this already. So you want to head over here. One cool thing though that I like what they did with the fire shield is that uh, every time you touch oil and you have the fire shield, you ignite the oil. You know, it's pretty interesting, but it doesn't do anything except hurt tails. Obviously, you're immune since you're the one that's using a fire shield, so fire has no effect on you whatsoever, but all it does is hurt tails. Alright, so here we go. I don't know, man. This this level, like I said before, I was never fond of Oil Ocean. Like, when I played Sonic 2, it was one of those levels that I just never really gravitated towards. It was one of the, you know, it's one of them levels that you just loathe playing. I don't really like the level itself. I don't like the boss of the level. Actually, the funny thing is, I think the boss in this game is actually harder than the original. And, and the original boss was pretty hard, but yeah, here we go. You want to go up here, make sure you spin dash. I find taking a top route is usually, like, the less stressful route. Get rid of these seahorses, man. Them seahorses are annoying. What you want to do now, you can use that thing over there, but it's better if you just push these spikes and head down here and get this one up. Alright, we're going to get some rings. Should be a lightning shield somewhere around here. Yes. That's what we want. Head up here with the lightning shield, get rid of these Splatoon enemies. You, know, you got the octopuses. Alright, let's head down here, Splat Nation. Whoa, whoa. These freaking spiky star things, I don't know why, but they always gave me, like, anxiety as a kid. I always tried to steer clear of those whenever I could. Alright, there we go, another extra life. Love this music though. I always like Oil Ocean music since the original. Alright, so you wanna head down here, slide down the oil. Did we hit a star post yet? Oh, here we go. Where are the star posts? Oh, there's one. Alright, bonus stage time. What we got here? This. Again. I really don't like this one. Will we ever be able to do this one? I don't remember how I did the original. 
I definitely did it on the Switch, but I'm gonna try the best I can. Okay, we got, what, 35 more? Uh, hey. <sighs> Wait! Ah! Ooh, my gosh! Like, why does it end like that? What am I supposed to do? I, I don't know, man. Wait, I can go up here? What's up here? Wait. Hold on. Here we go. Made it. Oh, extra life. I didn't even know about this. I literally just discovered this just now. There's always something new to be learned in Sonic. In my personal opinion. Now you want to head down here. Get rid of this guy. Oh. I actually don't need that to get up here since I got the Thunder Shield. And here we go. This is the boss of the level. This guy. Okay. You want to avoid hitting directly underneath him. And also, stand on the two pipes in the middle. Otherwise, you're going to get hurt. Like, be patient with this one. Okay. There we go. Alright, so far so good. He's out of there. I know on my practice run, he was giving me trouble. But yeah. You know, Oil Ocean Act 1 was pretty uneventful in my opinion. It was, you know... Not much different than the original stage, and I never liked the original stage. But yeah, uh, gotta do it for Oil Ocean Zone Act 1. And here we go. As if things couldn't get any worse. Here we are on Oil Ocean Zone Act 2, which I personally think is the worst level in this game. But uh, yeah, you're gonna see why I hate this level so much when we come back next week. But uh, remember, if you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to smack that like button, subscribe to the channel, ring that bell for no notif uh, notifications for more content, and I'm going to see you guys next week. Peace out, Splat Nation.